Hey, this is Chris with Delaware Paddle Sports. We're here today in Cape Henlope State Park. We have the Jackson Kraken. We're fixing to go out and do some little fishing in the uh, in the bay here for some tog. But uh, I wanted to introduce you to uh, Brian Kidd. He's one of the owners at Delaware Paddle Sports. And Brian's gonna go over uh, from bow to center hatch. And then I'll go over the thermo rest and go over the K crate. So Brian, take her away, my man. All right. So yeah, we're pretty excited to get this thing out in the water here for its uh, maiden voyage. But we'll walk you bow to stern here. Uh, you got your drain plug right in the bow. Uh, your Jackson grab loop handle. You've got the beautiful Kraken logo right there. And then uh, you've got your hatch cover here, which uh, is nice and sleek design. Underneath, you have a very nice neoprene. Uh, cockpit cover, uh, keeps that nice and watertight. Large hatch, there's actually a battery box in here for uh, battery storage uh, through fish finders and uh, uh, we know whatever electronics you're running. So then walking back here, you've got two gear tracks, uh, your GoPro mount, and then we can kind of talk about the new uh, redesigned center hatch Jackson has here. Um, comes with the light, so if you're launching in uh, early morning, um, you know, you got a little extra illumination there, help you out. Your uh, Ram 2007 style rod holder, gear tracks on the entire hatch. And then this hatch actually swivels up and opens like that. So, you know, if you're out in rough seas, your hatch isn't gonna get lost, get away from you. You've got your uh, center hatch insert inside there as well. And then uh, new for this year, Jackson's upgraded all of their foot pegs, so you get a nice cushion uh, Jackson logo on your uh, foot pegs there. All right, that's the uh, front part. All right, guys, so we're going to go over the uh, the seating, which is really cool. The design uh, by Jackson Kayak and Jim Salmons uh, really is making this a trimmable boat with a very high quality seat, very comfortable. Uh, basically, when I say trimmable, you can take and put bigger fish in the front end towards the bow, and then that's gonna bring the nose down a little bit. But what you can do is, is keep your seat a little loose, and you can trim your boat where you can move this seat backwards, like so. So that way you can get that nose back up and you can get a good cut and a good glide in the water, which is killer. Great idea. So there's many settings here uh, that you can put in um, and to make sure you know that, that you are trimmed out correctly. Also, with the new seating that Jackson has out, they have the, uh, the Thermarest. And the Thermarest, you basically can blow into this. It's a bladder. Once you blow into it, you can fill it up so that way you get a lot of good comfort on your lower back, some really good support. The, uh, the seat is made of a high quality fabric, um, waterproof, that'll dry out in the sun really quickly. And a huge thing too is a lot of people say, well, you know, uh, black seats get kind of hot. Well, here's the thing. What they've done is, is they've taken the mesh and it's actually, it's open through it so that way when you get a breeze it cools you cools you down which is a really good feature with these seats also underneath the seat they have the plano box storage the way you can keep a lot of good tackle items up underneath the seat and out of the way very clean lines and basically you just attach that back on and then that way your plano box is secured inside the seat so as we go back <clears throat> you'll notice that there's another Plano box. So basically you can keep a lot of storage items inside this. Um, keep a lot of different products inside here. Uh, you keep more tackle in here. You can put an additional battery in here as well. And it all cinches down and it's lockable on this bar, this tracking. So 
in the event that you do flip your kayak these are definitely going to sit in there along with the K crate as well the K crate which is a really nice design is is that uh, you have the open storage just like the J crate but you can convert this into a live well system which is really cool and you'll notice uh, on the K crate it still has the track mount so that way you can put a nice Visi Carbon on there Visi Carbon Pro um, and you can also put a, a GoPro on here as well it cinches down so that way the lid's nice and secure and then it also has the track mounting too with the screws so that way this keeps this unit inside the kayak just in case it flips now with the K crate and we're talking about the live well system you can physically take this seat move it forward pull this the strap so you'll notice down inside the Kraken, they have a nice opening here that you can get a pump to put inside this in order to circulate water inside the K-Crate. And uh, the pumps are optional. And the cool thing about the pumps is, and I have a lot of experiences with this, is priming the pump. And just as uh, Jim Salmon said, you know, when you put that pump over the side, it's either hitting the side of the kayak or sometimes it just doesn't prime and you got to sit there and try to get water inside of it to get good suction so what you can do is put this nice pump that you can get as an accessory through Jackson and you can get it right through us at DelawarePaddlesports.com and put it right down inside the bottom of the kayak and it primes itself you don't even have to be sitting in the boat it physically pulls that water for you so that's a nice feature too plus it's laid down inside the kayak which is killer you also Going back to the stern, you have a nice big storage area back here that you can put some clothes in a dry bag, or you also have the back hatch, waterproof hatch that you have storage inside. And then also with the Kraken, you can get the rudder system. They physically put the tubing inside the uh, Kraken and all of their Jackson boats. But uh, when you go to get a rudder from us, <clears throat> we'll physically uh, start installing these for the customer. So um, I think that's about it on the crack, and we got to get her out there and start splitting some water, right? Yeah, it's time to go fishing. Time to go fishing. Let's do it. All right. So, guys, thanks so much, and uh, we're going to get out there and visit us online at www.DelawarePaddleSports.com, or you can give us a buzz at any time at 302-645-7300. Let's roll. Hey, this is Brian with Delaware Paddle Sports. We want to show you the best paddle on the market, a Werner paddle. Come on and visit us out at the shop or on DelawarePaddleSports.com.